what is up my beautiful people welcome back to another video with your girl Pamela Janani welcome back to my channel what is the vibe my beautiful tribe happy Sunday if you guys are not subscribed to my channel please go ahead and do so right now support me on this journey that I always say is bigger than me because it is right let's go so um you guys know about sex traffic tra sex trafficking right trafficking it's disgusting it's nasty and it's um, and unfortunate that I have to explain to my 12 year old daughter that it exists because even two years prior to my daughter um, being 12, obviously 10, right? Um, I encountered a lot of disgusting, perverted men looking at her, looking at a child. And when I say that I wanted to be cutthroat and just really shake this person up, because it was one man in particular, I wanted to do that. You know what I'm saying? But I want to tell you that um, as, a, as a person who is, um, you know, I'm, I'm a chosen warrior, right? Um, and I know that for myself growing up, I was definitely shy. I was very shy. I was very quiet. And, and, and if you spoke out of line to me, even in high school or middle school, I would he 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 about it. You can diss me and I would he 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 about it. And I didn't stand up for myself. Okay. And I'm going to say that changed when I got, when I had my daughter, when you become a mom, the beast comes out of you. You know what I'm saying? So it changed a little bit, but I, I was still in that energy of he he he. Oh my gosh. You diss me. He he he. You know what I'm saying? And that's not an energy that I like. That's not an energy that I like. Um, and I was afraid that my daughter would be that way because she was, I'm, I'm a very good person, guys. And I'm not saying this to, to sugarcoat. I'm a very good person. And my daughter, I saw the same thing in her. And I was afraid that she too would be one of those shy girls and he, he, he. But my daughter is a warrior. She's strong physically and she's strong mentally, especially after what she has encountered within the past year um, from her father and the person that, you know he was associated with not to mention his family you know what i'm saying so she's become a strong girl but she's still a girl she's still a 12 year old girl um and i and that i'm that that we as parents have to protect you know what i'm saying but that being said um there's a lot of trafficking going on there's a lot of people out there who are watching little girls and little boys and grown women okay they're trying to take you and and be be mindful of vans and be mindful of people men who are linked up together who are in vans and who are standing outside of that van who are asking you to come over and help with that van don't go anywhere near these people they are disgusting they want to take people and they want to sell them and then these people will never see their family member their family again this is nasty behavior that is going on in this world and it needs to stop and a lot of people need to be more aware of it and, and as a spiritual person, I want to get back into that. Um, little girls like me and little boys who are just nice and who are he 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 at this is an insults, okay? We need to teach these little people, okay? And, and even as a grown person, you can be shy and, and whatever and maybe fall victim to being naive. We need to understand that we can be spiritual warriors. We can love God. We can want to do what's right for people and ourselves and the world. But we also know how to kick you know what I'm saying? We know how to stand up for ourselves and put our foot down and create boundaries to protect us and our kids. You know what I'm saying? So I'm encouraging you guys to teach your little girls and teach your boys. And if you are shy and you are one of those people who are, you know, easily manipulated and controlled, stand up for yourselves, okay? Say no when you need to say no. Stand up for yourselves. If somebody is mistreating you, you don't have to entertain or argue with them. Bye. Get out of my energy. And don't be afraid to say, I don't want you in my energy. Never be afraid to stand up for yourself and speak up, okay? And this is to family members, okay? Because family members, they may not be a sex trafficking person, but they can be a person who is trying to traffic your soul. You know what I'm saying? Your soul, your life, undercover soul snatchers, all right? We are to be mindful that we are to be nice, but we, we are also a warrior. We're a warrior for ourselves and for God and for the people who are in our tribe, you, me. I'm a warrior for you. I'm a warrior for your kids. And I want you to be a warrior for mine because when you and I do the same thing, we stand up for get together no matter where you are in Paris, London, Illinois, Michigan, no matter where you are in this world, if you're a warrior like me, then we're a warrior together. We're protecting each other's kids together. We're building our tribe up together. We're making God proud together. You know what I'm saying? So be strong out there in this world and put people in their places when they need to be put in their places, but also know how to straight up ignore them, okay? Because your energy is to be protected. You are loved, you are beautiful, and I'm a, I'm proud of you guys, okay? Because living in this world where you're good and everybody, not everybody, but there's so much toxicity and there's so many bad people and you're still good and God is saying, I love you for that, okay? I give you your flowers for that. 
in the best way possible. And that's in life, that in, that's in miracles, that's through healing, and so much more. All right? I love you guys. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Subscribe to your girl's channel. Give me a thumbs up. Share my content. Shop my store religious rubies down below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Love and light. Bye.